Apple has just done two things that perfectly capture its paradox. It became the third company in history to cross, well, here it is, $4 trillion market cap. And on the same day, it quietly released Pico Banana 400K, a 400,000 image data set for text-guided image editing built using Google's Gemini 2.5 models. That's right, Apple, the master of secrecy, just went open. And it did it using its biggest AI rivals, TechStack. Apple's valuation milestone isn't just a financial flex, it's actually a strategic reset. While Nvidia rides the AI hardware boom and Microsoft dominates AI software through OpenAI, Apple is positioning itself where the next revolution begins, that is, data. The company's Pico Banana 400K dataset marks a turning point in how Apple thinks about AI research, not as a walled garden, but as a shared foundation. It's a massive curated data set built to train AI models that can actually understand and execute natural language photo edits. Think, well, make it sunny. Um, remove the person. Or don't shut front page ever know. Sorry. <laughs> Zoom into the signboard. So basically, in a move that surprised the AI community, Apple's researchers used Google's Gemini 2.5, which is Nano Banana slash Flash Image, models to create and evaluate the dataset. Each image edit pair was generated, scored, and curated through Gemini's multimodal evaluation loop, producing one of the most structured resources ever released for instruction-based image editing. It's actually an odd alliance. Apple using Google AI to push open research, but it reflects a larger shift, and here it is. The new AI world isn't defined by corporate rivalry, but by cross-stack pragmatism. When innovation demands scale, even Apple collaborates. Most existing editing datasets are either synthetic or inconsistent, making them, well, unreliable for building real-world AI tools. Pico Banana 400K changes that. Balancing diversity, quality, and realism, and even including multi-turn edit sequences and preference pairs, where AI learns not just what good edits look like, but what bad ones are. For researchers, this means cleaner benchmarks and, well, faster progress. For Apple, it means something deeper. An acknowledgement that open collaboration is now the real competitive edge in AI. Apple released Pico Banana 400K under a CC BY NCND license. Basically, free for non commercial research use, but off limits for commercial applications. It's actually a cautious first step into the open source world, one that actually balances Apple's control ethos with the research community's hunger for accessible, high quality datasets. And yet, the symbolism is hard to miss. As Apple joins Nvidia and Microsoft in the $4 trillion club, it's finally signaling that AI isn't just about devices or chips anymore. It's actually about data. So finally, Apple's trillion dollar empire was built on closed ecosystems. Now, its next frontier, AI, might depend on how open it's willing to be. By releasing Pico Banana 400K, built using Google's Gemini, Apple isn't just contributing to research, it's actually rewriting the script, embracing openness, cross-stack collaboration, and data-driven innovation, just as it reclaims its place among the world's most valuable companies. So basically, in other words, while everyone else is fighting over GPUs, Apple is quietly building the future of creativity itself.